Eastern Democratic Republic of Congo has been ravaged by conflict for many years, resulting in the displacement of millions of people. Among them are countless minors and children who fled from their homes with no parents. VOS Bondiho was in Goma recently and filed this report. Over 1,500 people call this camp their new home. Most of the people here had homes, uh, had their life going on. But because of the ongoing war uh, between M23 and the Congolese forces, all these people that you see here have been forced out of their homes, and now this has become their homes. Perhaps what is even more distressing is the number of children in this IDP camp. These children are at extreme risk with limited access to food, water, healthcare and education. As you can see, there are a lot of young children here. Some of these children don't have parents. They fled as other people were fleeing. Some of these children are vulnerable to violence and exploitation with little protection from the harsh realities of life in a war-torn region. Desiree Faustin Vajambera, a community leader, fled his hometown of Fruchuru, walking nearly 43 miles to Kahembe IDP outside of Goma in eastern DRC. We are here because of war. You know, you had the uh, people from Ruchuru have for this camp because of this or um, from M23. It is the reason when we are here for this camp. Bajambera says many of these children can't go to school and have been separated from their families and have nowhere else to go. These children, he don't know, he cannot go to school because there is no place to go and we don't have the possibility to go to school and the, child, the main children don't have the family here. Aid experts say the plight of unaccompanied minors and children in IDP camps in Eastern DRC is a humanitarian crisis, requiring immediate attention and action from the international community. The many children don't have a parent. Community activists say the situation is particularly dire for girls who are often targeted for sexual violence and exploitation. Many girls are forced into early marriages or prostitution just to survive, further perpetuating the cycle of poverty and hopelessness. Paul Ndiho, VON News.